Hey everybody, Greg again here. Asked my wife what she really liked me to plant in the garden this year, and her immediate response was onions. So guess what? I'm going to plant some onions. I'm going to plant a full package of onion seeds in a single tray. Onions have a very fibrous root, and the vertical way the leaves grow make them very easy to tease apart during transplanting. So you can really start them extremely close together. They're going to almost look like, uh, like grass when they're coming up. They're going to be that close. Uh, another option for growing onions is using sets, which is basically a small, uh, small bulb. Uh, but from what I understand, growing from seeds, you'll actually get a better yield. You want to get your onion seeds started early, because it's going to take a good 12 weeks to get them to a good size to transplant outside. Part of the time you consider is you can actually transplant them outside four weeks before the last frost date. So you're really looking at up to 16 weeks before your last frost date to get the seed started. If you're looking past that date, don't worry. If you're still within the 8 to 12 weeks before your last frost, you're good. They should still be okay. Now, before we go on, one important thing to consider is that onions are separated into three different categories. Long day, intermediate day, and short day. This is actually in contrast to the standard consideration of gardening zones that we consider when we vegetable garden. All onions grow the same way. It's the way they react to sunlight that differentiates them. Long day onions begin the bulb formation when daylight reaches 14 to 16 hours. Short day onions begin their bulb formation when daylight reaches 10 to 12 hours. And intermediate bulbs are somewhere in between. In southern Canada, northern US, we'll be growing long day varieties. The image I'm going to show up here now Gives you an idea of where the daylight zones are in the U.S. Unfortunately, I couldn't find one that included Canada. Go figure. Thanks, Google. Now, I was hoping to get some Walla Walla onion seeds, but when I went to the store today, the only variety available were these Valencia onion seeds, which are listed as grows well in short to long day conditions. Since I want to get my onions started, I'm going to give them a try. What I've got here are two roasting pans that I bought at the dollar store. Actually. A couple of years ago, they get used and reused, and they work great. Um, for the seeds that I'm growing here, uh, I cut slits on the bottom of the top pan, filled it with soil. Uh, the reason for the slits is what I'm going to be doing is as they grow, I'll be dropping water into the bottom tray. You can see some there now. That is because I have pre soaked the soil for the seeds. But as they're growing, I will be lifting this out. Watering the bottom, the water will soak up into the soil. So let's get going on this. Basically what we're going to do is I've actually already opened this up to have a quick look at the seeds. So these are the seeds we're putting in and they're just going to get scattered throughout the container and again it doesn't matter how close they are they will easily be teased apart when it's time to get transplanted outside okay and there we have it. Now we're just gonna give them a little bit of a cover over here. It doesn't matter if there's still seed sitting on top, they'll still germinate. But uh, try to cover some of them over a little bit. Just give them a little head start. Okay, so that's it. Now I'm gonna get them onto my shelf, get them under a grow light, let them grow, keep them watered. And once I do get them transplanted outside, uh, I'm gonna be looking at probably about six inches apart for each onion, that will give them enough room to grow and expand to uh, good sized onions. All right, thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any comments, definitely feel free to put a comment below. Thanks very much, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye now.